in Roblox games. I love to live. Just two days? Oh right. It's fine. I have to tell with my group chat. I would like to spend the first day with them. And the last one with my family. I'm kind of sad when I know I have to leave them. They are all my best friends. I hope they can remember me when I left. In the group chat. Oh my god, Lizzie. I'm so sorry to hear what will happen to you. Guys, there is something I have to tell why. Stop, Xenia. You just interrupted us. Can't you see that Lizzie is crying? Because she has only one week left. Barrett, don't be rude to her. She didn't know. Um, I'm sorry. No problem, Xenia. It's fine. What are you going to tell us? Uh, I want to announce to you guys T. Sorry guys. I told my mom and she wants me to spend this whole time with her. So can we play Dahud for the last time? Of course, we can. We can do anything you want. We want to see your happy face. Thank you. You're so sweet. Can you all take a moment to listen to Xenia before playing? Thank you so much. I don't want to play the hood because I... Why are you suddenly so selfish? Did you not hear what she said? That may be the last day she stays with us. If you don't want to play or be friends with us, you can leave. At least let me finish. I think Xenia has her reasons not to want to play with me. I know not everyone likes me. And I respect that. Don't say that, Lizzie. You're amazing. Let's play Dahu. Goddamn, can you all please shut the f*** up? Xenia wants to tell us something. And you all keep interrupting her. You can keep talking, sweetie. Thanks. What I wanted to say is that I... What? Haha, <laughs> don't worry. She always has bad Wi-Fi. Well, she deserves it. That's the price she pays for being selfish toward Lizzie. Haha <laughs> Barrett, don't say those things. I think she doesn't mean when to do that. By the way, let's play Dahood like you want. Okay. After playing game. That was fun. You guys are all amazing. You are welcome. What else do you want to do? There is still one thing I would like to say. I have kept this secret in my heart for a long time. Because I don't have much time left, I want to say it. Is this something bad? No, well, Matt, I really like you. I liked you since the day we met, but I can't tell you because... Oh, thank you, Lizzie. As you know, I have a girlfriend, and I really love her. I know, I also know that you two have been dating for two years, but... But? I always dream of a date with you. Can you make that dream come true? What? No way. I'm sorry if it makes you uncomfortable. But because I only have a week left. Bro, don't be mean like that. You just need to date her for one week. This is her last wish. No, I can't do this with Xenia. Dude, it's just one week. I'm sure Xenia would understand. Still no, I'm sorry, Lizzie. I appreciate our friendship, but this is my limit. I understand, Matt. All I want is to know what love feels like before I die. I've always dreamed about being your girlfriend. But it seems like you don't like it, so it's okay. You are really an asshole. For real. Fine, Lizzie. As you wish, I will become your boyfriend for one week. But I want to tell Xenia about this. Wait, that means I'm really in a relationship with you. Yay. Matt, let's meet up in real life tomorrow. We can have dinner and then go for a walk in the park. I feel so excited. Oh, sorry, my mom is calling me. I have to go now. See you tomorrow, Matt. Maybe this is not a good idea. I feel sorry for my girlfriend. It's fine. You just need to stay with her for a week. It's not even a week. She'll be spending time with her family on the last days. How about Xenia? Did she have something she wanted to tell us? I hope she gets her internet back soon. Don't worry. If she wants to say something, she will find us herself. A few minutes later. Matt, I know I have a date with you tomorrow. But when I told my mom we started dating, she really wants to meet you and wants to invite you to my house to have dinner. Can you come with me? Oh, right. Because your mom was invited me, so I will come. Thank you. See you later. Bye. 
Meanwhile, with Xenia in real life. Thank God, my internet is back. I have to find you guys quickly and let them know. Huh? It looks like all of them are not online. I texted them but no one replied. I'll go to Instagram to see if they have posted anything. Oh, Erica and Barrett are posting photos with Lizzie. I should post a photo with her too. Wait, is that Matt? Why is he with Lizzie? This is the house and that is Lizzie's mother. They have dinner together? And why is Matt hugging Lizzie like that? What is the relationship between the two of them? I better call him. Where are you now, Matt? Wait a second, Lizzie. Xenia is calling me. Xenia, it's good to hear your voice. Why are you with Lizzie? And what do you mean by the picture you posted? Are you to dating? Are you cheating on me? Calm down, Xenia. Let me explain. I was going to talk about this with you, but you don't have internet. Lizzie wants to be my girlfriend in one week before she goes. At first, I didn't agree, but Erica and Barrett told me I should do it. So I agreed with them for one week. You decided to date her without telling me anything? Why don't you call me? Am I not your girlfriend anymore? No, it's not like that. I don't like her. She is just my friend, and she just has one week left. But I'm your girlfriend. I even have two days. But it seems like you don't care. Fine. If you want to be with her, we are done. Wait, Xenia, wait. Is everything all right? Yes, it is. I hope Xenia is fine. I haven't talked with her. I also want to spend my last days with her too. Maybe I should call her later. In the group chat. Oh, Xenia, you're back. Your Wi-Fi is so bad, you should change to the other. Why are you forcing Matt to date Lizzie when you know I'm his girlfriend? Don't act rude like that. You know Lizzie just has one week left. Just let her borrow your boyfriend. I know it's going to be annoying, but you've got nothing to lose, right? Why did I need to do that? I don't care. You guys just care about her. I have. What the f*** you just say? How can you talk like that to someone who is about to die? What's your problem? The problem is that you won't let me finish what I want to say. If Lizzie have one week to say goodbye to you, I just have two days. What? what? I wanted to say at the beginning, but all day today you care about is Lizzie. I just have two days. I also want to spend my time with you guys. I know she is our friend, but so I am. And I don't want to be treated like that. Am I wrong? Am I selfish? I'm, I'm sorry, Xenia. We don't know anything. Why didn't you tell us sooner? Is there anything you want to do? We can help you? That's right. Tell us. We'll make it for you. You guys did enough. I'm out. We feek it up. I feel so sorry for her. I am the one who was rude to her all days. It's not time to blame yourself. We need to tell this for Lizzie and Matt. Guys, I have a wonderful date with Matt today. Matt, do you know that Xenia only has two days left? Actually, only this night and the next day. What the f*** you just say? You must be kidding me, right? Matt, I'm so sorry. We just knew for a few minutes ago. No way. It can't be true. She wanted to tell us, but we didn't let her speak. I feel so bad for her. Yeah, we've been so mean with her for no reason. This is all my fault. I'm really, really sorry, guys. It's not your fault. It's all our fault. I think we should call or text her. You're right. Mom, I want to spend the rest of my time with you. Oh, honey, what's wrong? I thought you would spend all day with your friend. They don't need me anymore, but I think it's fine. Because I am not staying here longer. I don't want to talk about it again. Now I just want to stay with you. I understand. Do you want to go anywhere? I want to go to the beach. This is wonderful place for the last day. Gray, get everything you need in the car. We'll leave in one hour. How about your work? Don't mind about it, sweetheart. You are more important than my job. Thank you so much, Mom. I can't believe it, Xenia will leave me alone. She tried to tell us but we wouldn't listen. I'm the worst boyfriend. I want to be by her side but she won't answer my calls or messages. I should come to visit her, although the trip can take up to two hours. But all that is insignificant, now I just want to see Xenia. Two hours later. Hello, anyone at home? 
Oh God, don't tell me she's already gone. Xenia, how can I find you? Matt, you are here. Did you meet Xenia? Is she okay? We tried calling and texting, but she never answered. I came to her house, but no one was at home. No way. That means we can't meet her last time. I don't know where she is. I even can't contact with her. Oh, she posted something on Instagram. She goes to the beach with her mom, but it's far from here. I think we can't come there to meet her. I'm sorry, guys. It's all my fault. Lizzie, it's N. Yeah, you're right. It's all your fault. It's all your stupid wishes that made this mess. Matt, this is N. You and Barrett too, because you don't let her talk and keep calling her selfish and annoying. Dude, calm down. We. Because you only care about Lizzie, you don't care about Xenia's feelings, you hurt her. And me too, I didn't give her the attention she should have. Now she is going to and think we hate her. He's right about anything. We treated Xenia so badly in her last days. And now we're driving Matt mad because we can't find Xenia. Are you guys mad at me? No, we're mad at ourselves. Now we lose a good friend without anything to say to her. Eight hour later. It's so beautiful, Mom. How do you feel, darling? I'm happy to spend this time with you. Thanks for doing this. I love you. I love you too, sweetie. And I would do anything for you. Hello. Hi, Sarah. It's me, Matt. I know Xenia is staying with you. She isn't answering my phone. Can I talk with Xenia for one second, please? Of course. Xenia, it's Matt. He wants to. No, I don't want to. Sorry, Matt. She doesn't want to hear. Please, it's really important. Honey, I think he really needs to. Mom, after all I told you, I just want to be with you. I don't want anyone to interrupt us. And what I wanted to say to him, I already did. We're over, please understand. I'm sorry, Matt. You can hear what she said. I'll hang up. Please don't bother her anymore. Are you okay? Yes, Mom. I love you. I guess it's over. I'm gonna lose the girl I love the most. And all because I don't listen to her. That's all my fault. Last night, 11.59 p.m. Mom, it's almost time. I had a great day with you today. Thank you for being by my side. Everything I have is you. Please don't forget me. I'm not. Honey, I always miss and love you. Goodbye, Mom. The next day. Xenia, we're sorry we didn't listen to you. I know you can't forgive me. I know what I did is unforgivable, but I hope the time we spent together made you happy. I'm so sorry, Sarah. We will really miss her. She is my best friend. I know. She loves you guys so much. Don't be too sad. Sorry, but can I have a private talk with Matt? Yes, we will go. Matt, I know how much you love Xenia. Why did you do that to her? I'm so sorry. That's all my fault. Don't blame yourself, at least. She looks like she's sleeping peacefully. She really loves you all. And you guys treat her like that. You were her only friend. She would always talk to me about you and how happy you made her. It's always been difficult for her to make friends. That's why she really love you guys. I just want you to talk with the other member about how much she loves you guys. I understand. In the group chat. Matt, are you okay? Shut up. I don't want to talk with you. Matt, please stop. Shut up you too. You're not her friend. Matt, Xenia is gone and we can't do anything else but remember her. Listen, I'm really sorry. But I'm as sad as you because she was our best friend and... No, you're not. If you really considered her a best friend, she would be. Everyone, Everyone please, please pay, attention. pay attention. The plan, the plan to, reduce to reduce the population, the population explosion, explosion has been successful. Has been successful. Now people, now people can people return can to their, their normal, normal lives, lives, with an average with an life expectancy, expectancy of 70, 70 to 80 years. Just one day. Xenia only needs one day. Matt, you still have me. Are you stupid? You really don't understand what you did. I don't want to see your face again. We are not friends anymore. Why is he being so rude? By the way, does this mean that I have more time? Ugh, how could you say something like that right now? 
Excuse me. Mao was right. We've been giving you so much attention for nothing. Look, now you have a normal life and Xenia is... Erica, that was unnecessary. Don't be nice anymore. You are also responsible for what happened to Xenia. Yes, I am. And I'm really sorry. How do you think I feel? But we have to move on. We can't do anything. Guys, can't you argue anymore? Shut up, Lizzie. Now that I think better, your wish is something stupid. Don't say that. I just like you. I don't know anything. And now you're going to blame it all on me. Okay, I think this is enough. Let's give each other some time to calm down. Fine, I'm out of here. Me too. One week later. Hi, Xenia. I'm back. I miss you so much. I wish you were here with me. Our team is currently giving each other time to calm down. I still visit your mother often. She is fine. Lizzie is still alive after a week. Everything is fine now, only you are missing. I will visit you in a few days, see you. The end. A random day in Roblox of the weird boy Richard. Katie, Katie, baby. Where are you? Show yourself. What on earth is she doing? She is still online. Why hasn't she replied me yet? Hello, baby. Have you been waiting for me? Of course. What on earth were you doing? Sorry, Richard. I was talking with my friends. Oh, okay. I just miss you so much. Haha. <laughs> All right. Do you want to join my friends group chat? No, not really. Oh, come on. It would be fun, dear. Fine. K. Perry added M. Fantastic 838 to the group chat. My friends, I have returned. Okay, girl. It took you a while to come back here. Why? And who is that Richard boy? He is my boyfriend. I added him here to introduce him to you all. I hope we can get along and play together. Hi, Richard. Nice to see you. My name is Miranda. Hey, Richard, bro. How's it going? And by the way, I'm Kanoi. Thank you for having me. You guys are so friendly. Merlin, are you still there? Say something, boy. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm Merlin. Welcome here. Okay, Merlin. People, can I invite you all to play Blocks Fruits with me? Yeah, sure. I've got no problem with that. Let's play, bye. No, not me. Ah, uh, no, I mean, not yet. Huh? What's the matter? Hey, bro, do you mind chatting with me in the private chat? Then we can join them in the game later. What's wrong, Merlin? Don't worry, Katie. Just a conversation between boys. Richard, what do you say? Fine, I guess. See you in just minutes, my friends. Okay. What's the matter, buddy? Hey, don't talk like we're close. Who on earth is your buddy? What? Are you oh? Shut up. Stay away from Katie. She'll be mine. You are so out of your mind. I hope we won't meet each other in person. Otherwise, I'll pour a bucket of ice water over your head right away. That might help you get yourself sober. Try to do it. What the? Get this off my head. You moron. I'll make Katie dump you. Just you wait for it. What a psycho. Luckily, I've been recording the screen the whole time. Good. I saved the footage. Let's join my girl and my new friends in Blocks Fruits. In Blocks Fruits. He's back. Hey, bro, what took you so long? What have you been talking about? Nah, nothing. Don't bother my friends. Let's enjoy the game and get some bounties. After hours. Thank you, my new friends. I had fun. Let's play again another day. Sure, bro. I agree with that. Yeah, me too. You are such a good player. Goodbye, Goodbye for, for now. now. Bye, Bye friends. friends. See you tomorrow, baby. I'm getting out of the game. It's time for me to do my homework. Hold on a sec. I think you should watch this to know what you need to do. Huh? What's that? Stay away from Katie. She'll be mine. You are so out of your mind. I hope we won't meet each other in person. 
Otherwise, I'll pour a bucket of ice water over your head right away. That might help you get yourself sober. Try to do it. What the? Get this off my head. You moron, I'll make Katie dump you. Just you wait for it. Oh, how awkward. What do you mean by saying that? Merlin told me that he liked me. I should have let you know that. What? Are you kidding me? Didn't he know that you already had me as your boyfriend? He knew, but he didn't give up on me. This is even more than enough. I want to destroy that guy. Okay, bye. Just calm down. I won't give him any chance to have a crush on me. I'll make it clear to him tomorrow, okay? Okay. The following day. Huh, where are those two? Why there are only three of us here. Listen, boy. You are my good friend, I know. But I cannot love you. Please, understand that. Besides, I cannot accept your rude behavior towards Richard. You should say sorry to him. What are you talking about? Stop pretending to be innocent. I don't want to show the proof one more time. Let me ask you one question. How long have you two been together? More than six months. What's the matter? What on earth are you playing at? Shut up. I'm not talking to you. Katie, we've been friends for almost two years. Please don't tell me that you trust him more than me. Of course, I am more trustworthy than you. Zip it, Richard. You want the real proof, huh? Look at this. Katie, she is nothing but a naive chick. I'm using her and making fun of her only. If you don't love her anymore, then break up with her. She deserves a better boy than you. Nope, not now. I'm not out of interest in her yet. I think I'll make fun of her for a little longer. You are such a jerk. What's the matter? Are you triggered? If you like her, then I must ask you to wait a little longer. Wait until I dump her. I will destroy you. Are you sure you can beat me? I'll give you my address. Would you dare to come and teach me a lesson? Where on earth are you? Ah, uh, I changed my mind. Find me yourself, and I'll prank you before leaving. What? What the? This is not funny at all. Ha ha ha. What a moron. Back to Richard, Katie and Merlin. Oh my god. What did I just see? What the? That's impossible. It's fake. I am not that kind of person. You have to trust me. He told me that he would have a way to make us break up. That video was nothing but his trick. Richard, enough. I think we shouldn't see each other for a while. I need to calm myself down. Hey, Katie, wait. Ha ha ha, it serves you right. Merlin, you prankster. Where the hell are you? I will get there and teach you a lesson. Sorry, but I'm not a fool. I won't do that, lol. Ciao. What a troublemaker. One week later. We meet again. Now what? Would you break up with your fake boyfriend? Shut the hell up, you troublemaker. Katie, I hope you are sober enough to notice that all of his proof was fake. I checked everything. And unfortunately, all of Merlin's proof was real. What? Are you kidding me? No, and we're breaking up. I cannot love a person who makes me lose faith in them. But don't worry, I will give you one chance to fix your mistake. We can still be good friends. That's not going to happen. I should leave here before you kick me out. But I want to say to things before I leave. You can't hide the truth forever. And when you realize that you've been tricked, don't come to me and cry. Ha ha ha, good riddance. Well, KT, as you know, I always have a crush on. Merlin, please don't get it wrong. Richard and I broke up, indeed. But I don't think it will work between us. I only consider you my good friend, Merlin. It's okay. I can wait until you say yes. Meanwhile, Richard. I can't believe it. How could she befriend such a toxic guy? Whatever. I will join a random game and have new friends. Hey, boy. What's the matter? You look sad. Yeah. I just broke up with my girlfriend. Oh. I'm so sorry about that. Do you want to join my friend group? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Let's go. In Sarah's group chat. Hey, girl. 
Who is this guy? Hi, my name is Richard. Okay, I can see that. Welcome here. My name is Lois. Hi, Lois. Okay, but hey, where is Emil? I have no idea. Maybe he is doing something else. Yeah, all right. Let's do a face reveal, shall we? Okay, I am the new member, so I'll go first. He is quite handsome. Yeah, I think so too. Let's show him our photos. What a pleasure. You two are so stunning. Thank, thank you, you, boy. boy. Don't thank me. I was just telling the truth. Okay, enough introducing. Do you all want to play something? Yeah, what should we play? Hello, my friends. Did I miss something? No, but yeah. We have a new member. Is that so? Hello, bro. I'm Emil. Hi, Emil. I'm Richard. What, Richard? What's the matter? You seem shocked. We're going to play T.O.H. Would you join us? No, I'm out of here. You three can hang out together. I'm not in the mood for games now. What's wrong with him? Why did he run? His attitude was weird and shady. He has never been like this before. Don't worry, I'll talk with him later. Let's play the game already, my friends. Okay. okay. Meanwhile, Katie and Merlin. Hey, boy, what are you doing? I'm waiting for you to text me. Stop it, Merlin. That sounds cringe. Ha ha, sorry. So what do you want to tell me? After kicking Richard, I feel pretty alone. But I don't think I'll return to him. And I think I will. Yeah, you should never give him a chance. And you should give me one chance. I don't want to be your best friend anymore. I want to be your boyfriend. Jesus, Merlin. Don't cut my words. Oh, ah, uh, sorry. I didn't mean to. But can you please give me one chance? I'm a faithful person in love. Yeah, okay. I'll give you one chance. Really? Ha ha ha. This is great. I love you, Katie. Yeah, yeah, fine. I just need a man anyway. Who cares why you gave me a chance to be your boy? And here, I have this for you. What are those things? My favorite items in the game. I usually use them to prank other players. It will turn their avatars into random ugly animals. That sounds hilarious. Thanks. Get yourself ready. I'm coming to your place. We shall go out for a movie. Okay, Merlin. Later. Sorry for keep you waiting, Katie. Let's go. Fine. Back to the game one more time. Emil, can we talk? Yeah, sure, my friend. What's the matter? Why did you run away when you saw Richard? Have you both known each other before? No, it's not that. Stop questioning me, Sarah. It will bring you nothing. Let me say this straight to the point. I felt annoyed when you added him to our group chat. That's all. You know what? You are always so bad at lying. Come on, Emil. We've been friends for years. You haven't hidden anything from me. Why are you doing it now? Are you trying to shatter our friendship by lying to me? What did you do to him? Say it, Emil. Fine. Okay, I'll say it. A random guy tried to make Richard and his ex break up, and I helped that guy with that. Of course, I was paid some money. I heard the whole thing. Thank you for telling the truth. You can still fix your mistake. Now what? Would you help me to restore my reputation? All right, all right. I'll help you. Thank you, Emil. I will show my ex the liar nature of the one that she calls her best friend. And here, this is for you. Why did you give me the Robux? To make sure you won't let me down. Thanks. Sarah, can I invite you to a cup of fruit tea later? Sure, baby. I would love to. By the way, can I ask why you treat me so nicely? Yeah, I would like to ask the same thing. All right, I'll say it straight to the point. I like you, Richard. What? what? My God, I'm so happy. Then you should know something as well. I like you too, Sarah. You were there when I needed you, and you even helped me without any conditions. Hello, people. Am I invisible? Can we go now? Yeah, let's go. 
Richard found Katie and her best friend at last. Here you two are. Richard, is that you? Now what? Can't you just give us a break? Merlin, I'm gonna take your mask off and put some dirt in your eye. Are you ready? What are you babbling about? Remember this guy? Huh? E. Emil? What are you doing here? Sorry, Merlin, but I'm going to betray you. Shut up. Are you crazy? You can't do that. We had a deal. Yep, and I'm going to break it. Go. Merlin hired me to create a fake proof to slander Richard. What? This is all that happened. Shut up. No. Here, this is 1000 Robux. I need you to change yourself into this guy. Okay, what's next? Then I need you to be rude to me. And you need to speak bad words about Katie in front of me. Okay. Back to present one last time. Emil, you traitor. Have you forgotten that I am the one who always loves money? I'll do whatever makes me money. As long as it's not illegal. Thank you, Emil. You can go now. Bye-bye. Well, I just showed you the whole truth. He doesn't deserve to be your friend. He is not even a trustworthy person. Katie, give me a chance to explain. It's unlike what you're thinking. Shut up. We're breaking up. I can't trust you anymore. You liar. You fake friend. You'll pay for betraying my faith in you. Hey, are those things prank bombs? Yep. They will turn victims into random ugly animals. Take this. Oh no, my avatar. Our friendship is over. And I will slap you whenever I see you in real life. So you better stay away from me. Who who who? Get out. Good riddance. I did what needed to be done. I'm leaving. Wait. What? Can you please forgive me? Come back to me. After a long time, I realized that you are the one I really love. Thank you, Katie. But I stopped simping. Besides, I have a new girlfriend already. You what? This is Sarah, my new girlfriend. No way. Yes way, of course. We had been in love for a long time. But you chose to trust your troublemaker friend's fake proof. Sarah and I have only known each other for over a week, but she was there when I needed to be comforted. She also helped me prove my innocence. Richard, please. I was wrong. I would like to say something. If you don't respect something while it's still yours, don't go looking for it after you've lost it. But don't worry, Katie. I will love him and take good care of him. Okay, baby. That's enough. Let's leave here. Hoo hoo hoo. I'm so lonely. I lost everything. After that. Enjoy your tea. How delicious. Well, thank you for showing up. I love you, bye. Oh, come on. Don't be cheesy, boy. Sorry, but that's what I am. You are even more adorable in real life. And I can say you are even prettier in real life. The end.